Welcome back, Maya here for the episode number nine. So, uh, this afternoon when I come to the game, I was about to loading my campaign and I found out that all of my saving files disappeared. So I had a fucking light mini heart attack because I really want to finish those series. I'm putting some effort on it. And yeah, losing all the files was like, no, this can't end like this. So I had some search in the forums and Google. And people say to ask on temporary files on your hard disk. And yeah, they were there on the temporary files. I don't know why, but everything is going okay now. So let's keep playing. I conquered Melilla on last episode and I'm about to sailing with Prince Afonso to Marrakesh and seize it for me as well. I will pass to the next turn. I don't have anything else to do on this one, I think. No, I move with everyone and I can't build anything for now. So, see you guys on the next one. I didn't mention it yet, but you probably, if someone is watching this, you realize already that this episode will be longer. In this week I will, I will upload episodes with one hour of duration to see if people prefer to watch longer or half, half hour episodes. I need to try some things first. Let us see, join a crusade. To where? To Gaza. I will not join it, I need my troops here for now, Marrakesh, 1000 florins and <laughs> I only have 200, Jesus, the corruption as always, this is so difficult to manage, for what I know the, uh, the only way to have lower numbers of corruptions is to have a good king as a commander and for now not the commander, but this shard here, authority, yeah. If you have a king with a lot of authority, your generals and your nobles will not steal a lot of money from you. Let's hope that the Prince Afonso the Factionaire have more authority than his father. I think I can't see it now, because he's not a king yet. Yeah, I can see it. So, I will sailing south to Marrakesh here on Malila things are looking great let me join those ones and try to retrain some troops yes I can retrain those and then I will need you guys the Holy Bible may okay wow a lot of kingdoms joined the crusade already Haha, <laughs> we are still start to doing better now. Okay, slowly but surely we will grow. Mm, nothing new here. The castle is repaired. And I have a new priest at Lisbon. Okay, dude. Lisbon, a new agent. Where do I need you? I need you here. And you will march south because I need to start convert those regions they have no catholics here <laughs> shit this army is marching south to Marrakesh but it's a low number but they have a medium size here but no big deal I can I can handle them quite nicely <laughs> okay my priests you are going march here I need you here Vasco, you come to Seville and during the turn the Leon's army are doing a great job kicking those Moorish yeah, they have a few troops now, 69 <laughs> only 8, 13 yeah, they are getting ripped apart and the main army is here at Cordova oh, this dude is still alive the fuck Okay, I don't have any monies. I'll move my agents 
I did move you already. You are still alive and doing awesome. You will stay here. And my diplomat. Let's make new relations. Following the roads. To the right. Okay. Can I found anything? Not for now, on the next turn I will. And my other merchant, finally. Yes, Irishith, the ivory. I think I can trade with this dude here. Fuck me. 9% chance. Okay, let us see. And I lost my merchant. Well, bad thing happens, too. This is why very hard is very hard, I guess. Okay. What can I do more? If I took some of my troops out, like those, then yeah, I think it's enough. The public order drops a bit, not much, but yeah, I need to stay here, because if I go to the field with my king, he's quite old, and if he dies, the troops will be alone, and easy to get smashed, so I need to be careful with that, as I think all my generals, they are quite old already. And I have no, not a single young, young general except this Vasco, but this dude, he has a deteriorating health. So <laughs> the game is really hard right, right now. Okay, I will pass another turn and I will siege Marrakesh on the next one. New turn. King of Aragon is dead, and our king is still alive. The Council of Novs, no, Nobles gifted me with 1,000 florins for my great leadership. Thank you, very thanks. And finally, finally I have some money to play with. Oh, this feels good. And 21 is end production. I think our series are looking better now. Okay, it's ready to upgrade Porto and Lisbon as well. What shall I upgrade first? I think Porto because I need to to make better units. So later on, I can fight against uh, Spain or Leon to be more, more precise. Okay, a rival army is here with low number of units. But I should get rid of them as soon as possible. Okay, I will make a new merchant, one more priest, to win this war against the heretics. Because yeah, in this game you only not fight army wars, but you need to fight religious wars as well. And they are really important. Okay. Nothing new. Small chapel. It's built on Melilla. Can I recruit a priest? No, I can't for now. I can't repair anything and I blow up all of my money already. Yes. Okay, my troops will disembark. And we can't reach Marrakesh yet. But on the next turn, we will. Ho -ho. This general, they rebelled against the Moorish. Those are rebels. If I had a diplomat close by, I would try to bribe him to my side because he's quite loyal and he is a great commander. I need so badly, generals. Okay, in fresh small numbers of units without a general. They are an easy pick. 
but if I conquer them, I have nobody to rule the town. So I need to wait a bit and see if I can get some generals. Adoption or I don't know. During the turn, the Leon troops moved and started to kill more Moorish. This is awesome for us. I mean, this is kinda awesome, but Leon is getting quite strong. Yeah, they start. They have already light men at arms and they are quite good. 16 as defense stats compared to Jivan's 10 and militia. <laughs> I compared as my militia, spear militia, they have <laughs> the double of defense. <sighs> Things are get, getting serious now. The priest, march south. Oh, Crusader army. Ok, good luck with that to Gaza. Diplomatics, nothing new. More troops for us. Ok, I already knew that. Let's move our agents. He's doing a good job here. He needs to be here. Ok. You stay there, my diplomat. Let us find new place to talk with. Polish. I think I talked with them already. Yes, I did. Do you want our maps for some money? Because I need money. Like 600? Okay, you decline it. And maps for maps. Okay, you, you don't want it. Let us find new people. Hungarian. Okay, on the next turn we will see it. Or a bishop. He's a bishop and his piety is quite low. But, but what can I do? <laughs> Only cry. Our cities are doing well, population is growing, public order is looking great. It's the most important thing. And yeah, we only have old generals. So, I will pass another turn. New turn, King of Jerusalem is dead. And finally, brothers and sisters, look at my money. Finally, we are doing great. So many profits because of taxes. Our merchant is is doing awesome since the start. Trade incoming because of our ports, our better roads, and the trade deals that I made with my diplomat. And our farms are <laughs> are growing. Okay, so I will upgrade Lisbon right away. I think. Yeah, I will do it right now. <laughs> what can I build more? A spy. A spy, 100 per turn. And a priest. Oh, priests are quite cheap. Okay, so the spy will wait. I'm not at war with Leon for now, so I will make more spears. This is enough for now. Hmm. A traitor to our people, Afonso? What? Our faction are betrayed us? Oh my dear lord. The only son of our king, Afonso Henriques, decided to betray us, and now is a rebel. And I was using him to conquer Marrakesh. Yes. Shit. <laughs> and he had a quite good army, that's why we earned a lot of money. And probably he was one of the generals that was stealing money from us. <laughs> Okay, those are bad news. But 
I will not give up. I think I can I can manage it. And my king is about to die. Let me see my family tree. Yeah, he lived this. Hmm, 72, 79, and 36 years old. Well, guys, things are not looking so good, no. But let's keep going. Our new merchant is ready to roll. Um, I will take the ship. The merchant. The merchant will wait a little bit more. You are still blockading the port. Yeah, I think I will take the merchant and trade Anne here. Or something different, like those trade resources. I don't know what this is, but I will find out later. War declared. Okay, that's because of the crusade. Let's build some things, since we have the monies for now. Seville. Garrison quarters, of course. Sylphs. More farming income. We need that. And a tunnel after this. Okay. At Melilla. They are still repairing the stables and the garrison quarters. Mm -hmm. It's okay. And let me give an eye at Cordoba. Leon army are probably ready to seize them. Okay. And my diplomat. Let's move him a bit more. This belongs to, I don't know, Byzantine. I already talked with you. Following the road, because if you follow the roads, you travel further. And let's go north. Game of lag a bit, but it's working now. Can I do anything else? Yeah, I can take my priest. Close to Melilla. I want another priest to march south. A young one. 42. 61. 33. Okay, I will take you. You will help. You will help Frederick Martins. <laughs> okay, he'll come to fish. And, yeah. Since I had this huge blow, losing my factioner, I will pass to the next turn and see if Afonso Henriques or any other general will adopt someone. Turn 47 started, a new mission, stalking Starting negotiations with Lithuania, I will do it right away. My diplomat, he should be close to it, that's why I got the mission. Okay, Pope, I will not join you, I'm sorry, but I have no army to do it. Lithuania, can I reach it? Yes, I can, I will do it. So that to there. Lithuanian army, Lithuanian town, okay. They are poor, they have a supreme power, and I am a supreme power as well. Nice. We want trade rights and an alliance, it's demanding. Okay, just trade rights, and I give you some maps for some money like 600. You are poor, so yeah, you want it. 
I want it as well. So, 500 more. Okay. End of the turn. On the green. More people joining the crusade. And my merchant died. Hmm. That's bad news. It was giving me a lot of income. The merchant trading the gold here. Okay, I think I made a new one. He's on Lisbon. And instead going to north, we'll come to the gold. How old are you? 36. Yeah. Could it be worse? Hmm, I think I can make a new merchant. Yes, because I make a new I made a new market here. At least when I can't. And Porto. Two more turns to be upgraded. Okay, I'll re recruit you after a long a long time. Lisbon. It's upgrading as well. I will not make any unit here for now. Silves. I can't retrain. Let me see the army. Yeah, another unit of spears. Sevilla. I can't retrain as well. Building a garrison quarters. Keep building it. And our king is still alive against all the odds with 80 years old. Bro, I am really sorry that you leave enough time to see your son, the factioner, betrayed our kingdom. That's that must be a huge blow to you. But I don't feel confident to march to take it with him because he will die soon. So, we'll come to Silves with our boat and we will take some troops here like some Ginatars and Archers and you'll march south. You will join him here. I had another boat. What is my other boat? Oh, I lost it. They probably rebel against me as well with Prince Afonso. Oh no, it's here. Haha. <laughs> Stupid me. <laughs> okay. So I will recruit more troops. Forget those peasants. And make more javelins. My agents, the priests, keep going to Moorish territory. You can't pass here because they have an army. Path blocked. This priest starting doing a good job. And you come to here. Well, I don't have more things to do here for now, I think. Oh, I can recruit more troops. But they are quite oof, a lot. They are really expensive and you don't need them for now. So let's go to the next one. New turn started and finally a candidate for adoption. King Claudio. Afonso died. Afonso died indeed. <laughs> At least you gave me a new general, a young one, and he seems to be quite okay. Night fighter. Ready for action. Okay. The thing is, I will assert him, and on the next turn, I will lose 5,000 florins just because I have a new general. And I will lose all of my money. Because yes, we are playing stainless steel. And after a long time, our Alfonso Henriques died. Dude, you did a great job indeed. You captured all Portugal. And some of Moorish lands. So, 
Rest in peace, my king. Okay. More. New faction leader, King Claudio. Oh, and yeah, Afonso died, and and his woman died with him. It makes sense. Okay, I recruited a new merchant at Silves. I will take him right away. Ready to trade. Hmm. To where? To the silver. <laughs> No, he will reach first the gold, I think. 24 years old. And 37, okay. I will change the plans, you will go to the gold, to go to the silver. The youngest one will live more to stay there. And that's important. This army... That's not a pro problem for us yet. Vasco. You join Sylvs, I need you here. I need these garrison quarters to be built as fast as possible so I can start to recruit more troops to Seville. I will need a buyer. Or a bowyer. I don't know how to pronounce it properly. Some more spears, they are always useful. And the troops. Well, March to Lisbon. And I will take King Claudia. This dude was adopted, I think. Let me see. Yeah, Alfonso Henriques adopted him. And now he's the king. And the next thing will be Nuno Brandes adopted by Claudio. <laughs> Shit, the royal blood has long gone. I'm sorry, Afonso, but nothing I can do. It's random things about the game that I can change. Okay, more spears. Let me see my army. They have no general at Malila. And what should I build in this castle? Practice range. Oh, I can recruit desert archers. They are quite good and archers. Okay, I will build one. Practice range. And I think I can make catapults at seals, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, I can, but not for now. Okay. Let's see our towns. They all are building something. And yeah, I'm sorry, those next turns they will be quite boring, but I need to make a new army with and join new generals to the fight because as you can see I have no generals to lead my troops. Only this new dude and those two, at least this one is about to die. And ba Vasco is not good to fight because he have a deteriorating health. Unhealthy you now. Yeah, he is an old unhealthy. So if he goes to the fight, he probably dies. Okay. Our agents, can I move someone? Yes, I can move you. Let's find Russia. Or in this case, the Novgorod Empire. Uh, go to north. Follow the roads. It's okay. Uh, our merchants. I move them. Priest. You come to here. You stay there. Stay. And the other one? This one. Okay. Nice. I have now two priests on the Moorish land. So I can start to convert, convert them faster. Let's jump another turn.